Hello world and all who inhabit it, it is I, the Great Sayran, and today we're playing a fan-made game. Um, apparently this game has been out for a while and I had just never heard of it. Also, I'm kind of dabbling more into PC gaming and some of the crazy wacky things you can do with it. But Hyper Dragon Ball Z is apparently an amazing fighting game. It's based on Mugen. I don't know if Mugen is like a developmental code or developmental genre. I'm really new to this. This game looks really fun. I've only really tested my setup with connecting my controller. I played around a little bit with Vegeta, who is my favorite Dragon Ball Z character. Um, there's a lot going on right now. <laughs> this is my we're gonna see how this game plays. We're gonna see how this game plays, and we're gonna have a lot of fun today. So I appreciate you guys for watching. Be sure to like the video if you like it, and subscribe to see more content from your boy. Let's get into it. So as is tradition per every Dragon Ball Z game I ever play, if he's unlockable at the beginning of the game, I always play with Vegeta first. Why? He is my favorite Dragon Ball Z character. I don't know, man. It's just something about Vegeta and that that character development art. I don't know if you guys been uh, paying attention to the most recent. Hey, come on. What's uh what's what's that arc? The granola arc? There's a lot of character development in there. Did he just after image me? Now a lot of people may be thinking, why not just play fighters? Well, one, fighters is is incredibly difficult. Oh gosh, I totally landed on that. Fighters is in incredibly difficult. Come on. There we go. Um, especially when the fighters come out, 2017, 2018. There we go. I don't know when it came out, but fighters is incredibly difficult. I'll post a fighters video if you guys really want to see it. It's really embarrassing for me to play that game. Um, I, I tried to make a video for it like the other week and it, it was bad. Oh no. He just keeps blocking everything, man. Maybe I can get it with a grab. Am I gonna win if the timer's out? I don't think so. Grab him. Oh, come on. I whipped the grab. Now I really I really haven't really been into a lot of arcade fighters. I really started uh, playing fighting games. I'm not like a main fighting game person. I, I had to choose like one genre of game that I normally just play all the time, no matter what, on whatever system. It's probably shooters. Did I win? Oh, Krillin won. Whatever. Uh, yeah, I'm not. I'm not good at this thing. Uh, <laughs> um, so any genre that I I'm probably the best at personally is action RPGs and uh, and shooters. So I do love fighting games just because of the inherent talent. It just takes. I mean, you guys probably seen the, the Draco Wolf video and I'll play against somebody who's played in some tournaments and I beat them. Just it's just fun. You never know what can happen in a fighting game. Um but uh come on I need that grab yo because he just keeps block he's blocking everything. I don't need all this tech. I just need you to take these hits. Um one of the one of my the games I first fell in love with that was a fighting game was was of course Super Smash Bros. Melee, but after that, like as an adult, like a little bit older, more mature into games, was probably uh I'm just getting baked. Uh it was probably what's that game called? Um Street Fighter, I think it's Street Fighter 5. I can't remember where Street Fighter was out when I was like coming up coming up because I think Street Fighter 5 has been out for like 10 years for some reason. This grab is just not happening. I'm playing with the D-pad too. I normally play with joystick. Um, except for fighters. I don't play fighters joystick. That's absolutely crazy. But any any other fighting game, just because, you know, I think arena fighters became super popular recently. Okay, I died. <laughs> okay, I am super trash at this game. <laughs> Let's try some freeze action. Um, I think arena fighters became popular 
recently and that just added to kind of the fighting game hype that's a really nice intro like what that's dope this is a fan-made game that's a nasty entrance that's a nasty entrance okay i can't lose with this that is a long what's that heavy is that my heavy it is oh, i'm definitely gonna play distance with this come on Ooh, ooh. okay maybe it's the character i had i don't know i don't know i don't care about tier lists in any game i play because i don't believe in tier lists okay that's not true I believe in tier lists, but I don't I don't believe in them making or breaking the game. Like Demon Slayer, at a high level, you're seeing nothing but Tomiyokas, um, Hinokamis, Akazas, Inmus, you're seeing characters like that. And that's fun, and that's fine, but for me, I don't want my entire playing experience to be limited to that roster of characters just because they're the best characters. Or they're the more most competitively viable characters. Um, oh wait, yes, yeah, we're gonna spam this. I don't know what I just did to do the headbutt thing. Oh, there it is. Do I need me to do this stuff? Is that why I couldn't do it at first? Cause I promise you I was trying. These quarter circle forwards and quarter circle backwards, I was like hitting those. I like how launches in the background are shooting up. Oh wow. That's a bull rush right there. Bull rush. Um, but yeah, I, I just don't want my entire experience to, of a game to be limited to these specific characters just because they're the most competitively viable. That just doesn't, to me, that's not, that doesn't make a fun game. If your game is so unbalanced that people will only use, you know, a few characters and you have a roster of, you know, that's you know four or five times the size i don't think that's that's not a good game to me but at the same time um i don't think that demon slayer has that issue i think demon slayer is pretty balanced i don't think there's i think if there's anything that's unbalanced it'd be like game mechanics it's not like characters oh wow he came back and got me on that kind of like um kind of like a what's his what's what's the thing they nerfed air, the air the air runs because you had like the two mains that's like all they would do is they would just run around you know it's made it's made surge more viable in my opinion i think you actually have to have skill with dodging to like avoid surges and stuff like that oh i tried to get him i thought it this krillin is good like this is clearly this is a this is the cpu <laughs> i'm looting through the cpu I'm, I'm, this is like my first time playing this game. Please don't judge me. No, block, 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 block. What's going on? <laughs> he was just holding it. Wait for me, wait for me to like drop the block. What? <laughs> I thought the game froze. This is ridiculous, bro. You know what? I can get him on the rolls. If, yeah. No. Did I win? Kind of won. This is this is this is ridiculous. This it's really embarrassing. Um, another thing about this game is that it is free, but you can support the um, the developers who created this game on Patreon or PayPal. 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 <laughs> on PayPal. And I love fan-made projects just because there's usually more love and care. Like, the fact that these are all, like, personally voice acted. Like, I don't know if you guys can hear some of the characters. Let me be quiet. Yeah, like that Krillin, the double Sweetie King. I don't know what he called it. Um, but a lot, of the, a lot of the characters, or all of the characters, actually, are voice acted with actual, like, people who aren't the voice actors because clearly that'd be a lot of money for them to, to hire the actual voice actors um i'm, I'm trying to get this this dude and his jumps 
He's got the reads on me, man. I just thought this game was cool and I wanted to share it with you guys. Um, this, this, goodness. I'm, I'm so trash at this game. To be fair, this is my first time playing this game and I haven't, I haven't played a, uh, I got nervous about the uh, Defector Dishes come back. I haven't played an arena style fighter game in a very long time. Like even, even fighters, which is a, what's it? What do they call fighters? A 2.5D or something like that. And people are like, that's not what it is. But uh, even if fighters in a sense is, I'm only winning by timeouts. So I'm not KOing anybody. Uh, even if fighters Z in a sense is pretty, pretty different from a normal arcade fighter. I'm not gonna fight this match because I clearly suck. That was Hyper Dragon Ball Z. Like I said, um, I guess I'll link down everything, the website and how you can get the game. Um, they also have DLC. Like I think they have Jiren DLC. They have uh, Goku Black and they have, who's the other guy? I saw on there, was it Whis? It was Goku Black and it was somebody else that was a work in progress. Um, but they released DLC, they just released the Jiren DLC a couple weeks ago, and that's kind of where I heard about this game. Um, but yeah, it's really cool. It's really cool. I'm just excited for like the fan market of games. I just think that, like I said, fans put a lot more love into the games because there are genres or IPs that they are actually in love with, in love with it so much to the point where they will create a whole separate game for free. I don't know if you guys ever played Pokemon Prism or any of the fan made ROMs, but same concept applies so that's going to be it for this video i'm going to see if i can crank out some more wins in this game it's really interesting um i don't know if it's something that i'll play consistently but i'm having fun with it be sure to like the video if you liked it um leave a comment down below am i just super late to the party have you been playing dragon ball hyper z for years and i'm just a super loser who's just not catching on this stuff and subscribe so you can see more content from your boy in the meantime i have some more videos on my channel right here on this beautifully laid out recommendations of more videos to watch thank you guys so much for watching in the first place and i will see you on the next upload peace